Hi, my name is Zaza Muchemwa and I'm the director of the stage reading of Widows by Ariel Dockman. The reason why I chose this play was because the play de deals with such issues like war, um, brutality, violence and systems of governance in a manner that is quite humane in the sense that we get to understand human conditions living under um, or totalitarian regimes we understand human conditions living post in, 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 a, in a place that is trying to come, that is trying to live post um, a brutal conflict. And whilst the place feels like it, it is set in a particular country, in a particular continent, the issues that it deals with and the way it deals with the issues, you get the sense that this is a universal story. This is something that is even, even right now as we speak, I'm sure that there are certain places that are experiencing um, war, the certain places that are experiencing brutality, the certain places that are experiencing um, injustice at the hands of people who are trying to hold on to power. And the beautiful thing about Widows is how it finds the woman's voice and it also tries to give the woman a voice in a space where they they have been silenced by by the system that rules their society in a place where patriarchy is still inherently part of a society and for me what was also interesting about working on this stage reading is that i had my ideas about the play i had my understanding of the play but my understanding of the play kept growing more and more even in rehearsal. Um, seeing the play I knew in the actors' eyes and how they also responded to certain things and how they also see, found some similarities with their lived experience or with other experiences of other places. So for me, as, as with any other Almas uh, stage reading, I've, I've also found um, some space and some time to actually grow my craft as a director and also to it's another way in which to keep myself on my toes as a director and that the next time i'm directing a full production i'm already a step ahead because i'm i'm practicing some part of my craft and definitely also the idea of adding to my repertoire of plays that i've read that i've understood I, i'm also understanding um, how plays are written, uh, understanding different styles and also understanding the structures of plays and how this play was written a long time ago but it's still, for me it's a classic and it's still relevant and the, it, uh, most of it is more in the way it's written, most of it in the way that it deals with the issues that were pertinent to that time that it was written for and at the same time it's also, it also saddens me that the issues that are dealt with in the play, there's still issues that are affecting some uh, societies in our world, that there's still some societies that are living under totalitarian re regimes, there's still some societies where women are brutalized, where men are disappearing, and where families are torn apart. And it's a problem that we have as a world, and it's a problem that I guess it's, it's not a problem that I can deal with on my own. <laughs> it's, it's a problem that I think can be dealt with when we address um, injust system by dismantling the tenants that actually uh, allow those uh, systems to actually exist and also sub being a support system for people who actually come out and speak out against brutality, people who actually come out and speak out against um, injustice. And I'm inspired also by the women in the play by Sophia, her strength and her defiance, and even the women who at the end find finding their space and finding their voice and also understanding that their power is in their collective strength. So yeah, it has been massively amazing working on this uh, stage reading. And of course, I do look forward to what we're going to find in the post uh, reading discussion with the audience and how the audience is going to also relate with the text.